Oh, yo, this is so difficult. Wow. Mm. Hey, I got two. Oh, wow. Hi, I'm Rachel, and I'm from America. I've been to many cities in China and met a lot of people during my trips. Everything here is so interesting. I've stayed at home for a long time during the first half of the year. I need more exercise. Is there a relaxing and fun sport I can play? Hello. Hello. Wow. Oh, wow. You're the most skilled Jianza player I've ever seen. How do you do it? Jianza, or shuttlecock, is a traditional Chinese sport with a long history of over 2,000 years. It has the same origin as British football, both of which come from the ancient Chinese game, suju. It can be played just about anywhere at any time, whether you're on your own, in a pair, or part of a group. Today, we're going to visit a master of making Jianza, Inwen. Hi, hi. Wow, Master Yinwen is the fourth generation inheritor of the handicraft of making Tan Qian Yan shuttlecocks, a well known shuttlecock brand in Beijing. Her shuttlecock was chosen for the big show of shuttlecock kicking during the 2008 Beijing Olympic Games. Master Yinwen insists on making shuttlecocks by hand. She thinks that shuttlecocks made by hand are much more charming. Mm. Yeah, turkey is like a treasure in America. For Thanksgiving, we will eat it every single year. But it's so interesting that in China, you use turkey feathers to make the jianzi. Mm. Oh, this is a goose feather, right? And this is turkey feather. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Uh -huh. I want to try. Can I try to make one? Mm. How many? Three coins. This is the So now we're going to put it together with the needle. Oh, wow. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, I'm gonna try by myself to finish making this janza. So I have three feathers I need to use, but I don't know how to put them inside. Put this around, maybe. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, yo, this is so difficult to do. Oh. Mm. Oh, wow. Oh my gosh! Is it finished? Yes! Oh my god! How can I never knew such a small thing like this Jianza had so much meaning to it. I've learned so much from you today. In 2017, Tang Qianyan Craft was granted as an intangible cultural heritage in Dongcheng District, Beijing. It is not only a toy for fun, but also an elegant visual art. Oh, wow. Hi, nice to meet you. Oh, wow. How cool. Hi, Nihao, Rachel, I make You'll find that it's very fun to play every day, but also very beautiful to look at when you're not playing with it. I'm so excited about Jianza right now. I actually want to go play and learn how to do it right now. So I will see you next time. Bye bye. <laughs> Huh? Huh? I got two. <laughs>